Right now, everybody, welcome back to the channel. I'm back in the video. Hope you're all well. Uh, Vlogmas is well and truly underway now. This will be the second video of Vlogmas, one before the big announcement on Sunday. So make sure if you're not subscribed, subscribe so you don't miss that. What's up? Oh, we are just finishing the last bit of Christmas decorations. It's just changing sort of stuff like tea, like I was going to say tedious, but not just like little things like bath mat. That does look really nice, actually. And you will have seen us pick that up in the last vlog if you watched that. We have also, we thought we had Christmas bedding. We didn't, please excuse the state of the bedroom here. But we are about to change all of that. Um, we have gone with this one. We picked it up from Argos. Absolutely right. In the last vlog, I forgot to outro it. Uh, apologies for that. We were go We went out yesterday for bedding and stuff we couldn't find any anywhere so we had to come home and order some um and we also went out for stuff that will be in next sunday's vlog mm? yeah i'll get to that as well um and i didn't really want to pick these up in case i accidentally sort of included it so i just thought i'll not vlog and i'll, I'll tell everyone what's going on but also end of an era um we sold the Canon, sorry about this, G7X yesterday, and also, you know yeah, sold the new camera that we bought for just before the holiday. Basically, the new camera before the holiday is just too big and too, like, clunky, and it's really good, but I just think it's not for what I needed for, and the G7X was on its last legs anyways, so they've actually been shipped down to, like, just outside of London. Um to get them checked and sold. So yeah, end of an era there. I am enjoying the phone though, to be honest. I think because I edit on the iPad, it all just transfers over nicely. And also, forgot to tell you about this in the last vlog, but me and Katie have bought a projector for Black Friday deals for the bedroom. It is incredible. No doubt Katie or myself will have something on there later, so we'll show you all that when it's set up. The camera quality, the picture quality on it is unbelievable. So if you are like us and you sort of have your bedroom set up a bit like this, obviously just ignore this, um, and you're a bit like, I don't really have the room to put a telly on the wall because we have a king-size bed, definitely recommend it, and I'll show you that later. But yeah, we are going to put the bedding on now, so I will catch you in a bit. Right, everyone, that is the bedding all done. That looks a lot better. We need to get the dirty ones downstairs. But yeah, I don't know why that one looks a lot more festive than last year. Bless you again, Katie. We have a little dash hound pillows there. And yeah, we are probably going to try and get a red one for next year or something. Um, but yeah, that looks a lot more Christmassy now. But for now, I need to quickly finish the video that's going to go out on Sunday, just gone, the last video you will have seen, so if you haven't seen that, check that one out after this one, but yeah, I'm going to quickly finish that and I'll catch you in a bit. Hi guys, I um, just thought I'd pick you guys up, just dishing up tea, it is a proper winter warmer for tea tonight, pie and mash. Oh, the weather outside is frightful, but that pie sure looks delightful. I don't know how the rest would go, but... <laughs> Let's just get on with it. Yeah. Um, yeah, so pie and mash. I am having gravy and Liam will be having some beans. So, yeah, I'm very excited for this proper winter warmer, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Yeah. Real one. Hello. Jess, what's this? everyone so as you can tell we are at kate's mum and dad's for the week but first is there a key i need a spare key because yes. i haven't got a key to get in and i finish before katie finishes so just just loving a new toy there hello hello <laughs> yeah so there's this one all right um, the difference is one of them's got a little stick oh, on i've got an say, option oh for the yeah just a stick at the same which which is which door okay 
Or there's my dad's square key, uh, not my dad's key. Yeah. Um, and it's easier to tell the difference because the front door key is Aston Villa and the back door key is plain. Wait there, so you're asking me if I just want a plain key or one with Aston with Villa the, on it? Up the villa. Okay, I'm leaving this household immediately. <laughs> no, I will take, I'll take the plain key. Sorry, Stu, but I don't want to be representing Aston Villa. Up the villa. All right, everyone, it is now the next day. I know Will's worst vlogger, but I forgot to sort of explain why we're actually at Katie's mum and dad's this time around. And the reason is the person that you see when we first walk through the door. Little Jessie. We are here because of her. Um, so obviously we've had Jess, if you've been watching the channel for a long time, we've had Jess at our house before, um, but she is actually getting older now. She is struggling to get upstairs and stuff like that. Um, so we just thought, that this time we would come to Katie's mum and dad's. I feel like I've got something stuck in my mouth here, sorry about that. But we thought we'd come to Katie's mum and dad's and watch her here where she was in her own sort of home comforts because the last time we had her, she did sort of wee on the carpet and stuff a lot, which obviously we don't mind. Well, we do mind, but because she's getting older and stuff like that. So we thought we'd come here and maybe just see if it would be a lot better with her being here it's not like that she's a bad girl or anything like that she's just she's getting old and she's struggling to get upstairs like i think the last time i don't know if i mentioned it but like we had it upstairs and she just like was refusing to come down on a morning and that's because like our joints are getting bad and stuff like that like so we just thought we'll come here um and yeah that was that is basically why um with the floor and obviously we got that all cleaned and stuff like that, so that's obviously all fine now. And we are planning on ripping that up as a little spoiler. Um, next year, the sort of floor and downstairs is all gonna get changed. So no biggie there. But like I said, it is, it is the next day now. It is Tuesday, but tomorrow, so Wednesday night, we are actually gonna go to Newcastle Markets, which I am excited for. Love Christmas markets. So we're gonna take you with us to see how the Newcastle Market is this year. It is the last two years, I think it has been unbelievable and I don't actually think we went last year and filmed but we went the year before also didn't film but I went with my mum and dad the year before and they did a Yorkshire pudding wrap and I'm hoping that that is it this year so we'll take you along with that and um, I am currently just prepping my dinners and um, there's something that I actually kind of want to talk is about like it is quite serious and I also just want to sort of be honest because I was sort of on YouTube so sort of being a Katie's mum and dad's um, we are using a YouTube account that isn't sort of logged in so when we've watched like a couple of videos it's sort of just recommending a lot of new videos Um also Katie's mum and dad's Christmas decorations and stuff definitely put ours to shame like they have got so many from just collecting them over the years Um oh Jess is playing with that toy Oh, it's, she's playing with the one that we got her yesterday, aren't you? Oh, she's getting camera shy. She's getting look. Oh. That is the most, by the way, I've seen at a night because she literally, I walked in here before, sat down with a cup of coffee. She sort of sat down and looked at us and just walked in the dining room. Um, but anyways, YouTube, and it's sort of just recommending channels that like I've never really come across before or never watched. Like, oh my God, Joe so like I used to watch him loads when i was growing up um and it's just like it made us go oh like let's sort of see my channel and it sort of like took us back to the sam fender vlog and i sort of look at this year and i look at sam fender in particular as like post sam fender and pre sam fender and pre sam fender life was amazing post sam fender that was when me, me grandma got diagnosed with cancer like since then me um I will get onto that as well because there is a big update with that and that was what I sort of wanted to get to because it reminded us that I hadn't sort of told you. Um, but post Sam Fender, I'm going to have to sort of hold you like this. Post Sam Fender, like genuinely my life fell off a cliff. Like I said, my grandma got diagnosed with cancer since then. My granddad's also in a care home now and like a few other big things that have happened that I don't really want to share with YouTube because it's just... You sort of feel like there's some things that you can tell and there's some things that I just don't really want to share. Um, and like everything, like even just like in hindsight, this is so awkward with the phone, I need to get a hold of it. Um, in hindsight, 
with the things I've just said, the things that I'm about to mention are like comical. So like diet has just like fallen off a cliff. You can probably tell by my face. My face looks fat. Like I hate genuinely how I look at the minute. Um, and like the gym, haven't had, I don't think I've been in the gym since before the holiday, which was like five months ago, like consistently at all. And it all just sort of adds up, doesn't it? And it makes you feel crap. Like I genuinely don't feel bad at the minute, but yeah, um, but anyways, on the news, my grandma actually finished her chemotherapy. Um, I'm going to put some like a clip on the screen now of when she rang the bell. She was a little bit shocked that she got to ring the bell because she thought she would just ring the bell when she was di like undiagnosed or like cancer-free. That's the word I was looking for. Um, but she got to ring the bell when she finished her chemotherapy. Genuinely the strongest woman I know, my grandma. Like, it's hands down now. Like, she's all she's raised three kids, like countless number of grandchildren like pretty much to let our daughters go to work and yeah she rang the bell to finish her chemotherapy in like one of the roughest times for my family and like it genuinely was just amazing so I'm hoping we get good news to go into the new year or in the new year I'm not too sure how many weeks that's going to be but I thought I would just update you on that because obviously I did tell you about it a few months ago and yeah just really proud of my grandma. But yeah, on lighting news, I did have to take a break there because my arm, and I've put my arm back up now, and it has made me think about, I will put an image on the screen, but have you ever seen the video or the clip? Um, it reminded us of an idiot abroad of that guy in India that just holds one hand in the air. I mean, like, that is what I need right now, my arm to be, like, for when I'm vlogging with the phone. But we will get round to something. Whilst we're at mum and dads, they have an air fryer. We have asked for one for Christmas. I do believe we have asked for one for Christmas off Katie's mum and dad. So hopefully Santa Claus brings us that. Um, but yeah, we're going to get to use the air fryer. I'm hoping, oh my God. I'm hoping Katie's mum or dad or both of them explained how to work it. And Katie knows how to do it tonight because we are going to have chips tonight. I'm not actually sure what we're having for date night. So I will show you that. And I will also tell you about the air fryer. If you have an air fryer, you're probably like, oh my God, you're like two years late to the party. But I can't wait to see how they look because everything just looks so crispy in an air fryer that it looks unreal. And it just genuinely, I seen someone the other day on TikTok genuinely make a full, not roast dinner, fry up, like English breakfast in an air fryer. And I was like, unreal. So yeah, I will tell you about that and sort of, I hope it's good because we asked for one for Christmas and the chances are we will get one for Christmas. So I'm hoping we like it. But yeah, if you haven't already, please remember to subscribe to the channel. I would I would love to hit 600 subs. Is this recording? It is. Before Christmas. Um, that is like, oh, before the new year, whenever. But yeah, if you're not subscribed, please subscribe. Like the video as well if you are currently enjoying. I am currently trying to get into this baby proof drawer. I have no idea. This is not just baby proof, this is laying proof. This is unbelievable. But yeah, I'm going to try and get in the hay to get a fork out so I can stir my pasta. But yeah, we'll catch us in a Right then, I was talking to the camera before. The big question, did your mum or dad or both tell you how to work the air fryer? Yes. <gasps> so we're going to use that for chips. The current decision is just do we have burgers or do we have... I'm, I'm swear down Alexa's listening to what, whatever's going on in this house, it's but... because of the, uh, of the delivery, it's shine. I, I remember that. Our shine's a different colour when there's an Amazon delivery. When there's been a delivery, it shines. It like, but the little, like that, the little yellow yeah. light, it's... Because it's connected to the Amazon account, it's saying that there's some, like, a delivery That's here. Bizarre. I don't know what you need to say to get it to stop doing it, though. Yeah. Um, oh, sure. so yeah, whether we have burgers or whether we have these pepperoni parcels. Mac and cheese. Mac and cheese parcels. Oh. No, not pepperoni. I think do the mac and cheese parcels on Thursday. Yeah. Alexa, yeah. what's up? Let's set your preferred news channel. No. You can choose ah. sources <laughs> like Now I'm going to go in the shower while Katie oh. sorts all this out. Right, everyone, excuse the hair. I've just had a shower, but main event time, Katie. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> oh, 
they sound really hard and crunchy as well, don't even they? Even after 10 minutes, I went, I came in after 10 minutes just to give them a yeah. shake, and even then you could Kel. hear the crunchy oh. crunch. Get in. So we're having just burgers. And their cheese to melt now. Oh, cool. Burgers and chips tonight. Um, Arsenal also play later, so I'm going to watch that. Probably just put yous down now for tonight and pick yous up tomorrow when we're on the way to the Christmas market to when we're there. And then that'll be the end of the vlog. So stick around for the Christmas market. Like I said before, subscribe if you're not already. And I'll catch us tomorrow. All right, everyone, it is Thursday now. Um, as you can tell, we didn't go to the Christmas markets. I had, well, I still I have got a cold. And yesterday just happened to be the worst day for the cold. It would have been touch and go whether we went anyways because the weather has been non-stop rain for like the last two, three days. Um, and with what's happening on Saturday, so the vlog you'll see Sunday, I really need to be better for. So I, I, I didn't want to even just risk it and go with the thought of potentially getting worse. Like I need to be better for Saturday and you'll see why on Sunday. So... I hope that explains that. I hope this vlog has been enjoyable. It has been a little bit different, quite a lot of talking. Um, but everything will be back to normal in the next couple of weeks. And we have got some re something really exciting coming on Sunday that is going to change mine and Katie's future, to be honest. So stick around for that and subscribe if you're not already. Like the video if you did enjoy it. And I will catch you in the next one.